kill. Feels fantastic. I know it was close at relays with David. I didn't want it to be that way today. So I uh, did my best to take it out of him early and not let him come back. Looked like it was after that second or third lap you slowly started to pull away. Did you feel that or what was? Yeah, I was keeping track on the video board down there. When I was on the back stretch, I could see when there was no one behind me or when they would come. Yeah. What was the uh, Yeah, what was the celebration? <laughs> my team, they forced me, not the coaches, the coaches were totally against it. But the athletes, they forced us to do uh, celebrations, like if we win. I didn't know what to do, and they were like, shoot a free throw. I was like, all right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's it mean to you to be a state champion? Uh, it's fantastic. This feels way better than cross, because I feel like I fought more adversity for this one, and I felt like uh, the competition was more intense for this one, and it made me work harder. How'd you approach the heat, man? I mean, you mentioned coming off, it's hot. <laughs> uh, well, my coach always tells me that everybody's running the same temperatures, the same weather. I was like, if they're running the same weather, I'm running my same race. So I just went. Definitely. I know you've come close here at State in recent years. You are able to win Drake this year. How does it feel to kind of get this one out to start your week? Uh, this feels fantastic because to me, this looks like the worst day weather-wise. Maybe some storms tomorrow, maybe some storms Saturday. But the heat, man, I kept flashing back to the Heartland cross-country meet, which is where we had like the worst heat I've ever run in my life. My teammates had heat strokes. It was just terrible. I was scared someone was going to today, but I didn't see anyone laying on the side as I was going around, so that's good. <laughs> Definitely.